Hi, I'm Mark from LM Small Engine. Today we're working on a John Deere push mower. It's a Momentium dry system. It's a JS35. The reason they brought it in here is because of this. It looks like what one lever raises and lowers all the tires all at once. Anyways, they went to John Deere. And they can't get that piece for this no more. So they asked if I can try fixing it for them. And I said I'll take a look at it. So we'll see if we can not get this fixed for them. Go ahead and pop them tires off. There we go. Looks like the spot well just broke out of there. So I think I'm going to take this piece off here and re-drill this hole out. Take it in there and tack it a few times and spray water on it because I don't want to melt this plastic piece right here. I thought that had been metric, but it's a 3 8 nut on the 7 16 head on the bolt. So anyways... I'm going to drill that out. See where it broke out right there. I'm going to drill that out all the way. Slide it back on that shaft and tack it, cool it, tack it, cool it. Because like I said, this piece here is plastic. I do not want to melt that. So I'm going to drill it out and be right back. Okay, I drilled it all the way through. Okay, now I gotta measure both axles and make them even before I attack that. That way, all four wheels will all be on the ground. If it's off a little bit, then one wheel is gonna be up in the air, and we really don't want that. The bottom's at four inches. Well, that's really close right there. Okay, I'm going to get the welder ready now. Sprayer full of cold water. So I don't want to melt that plastic bushing. Keep that thing cool. almost got her in fact i might just leave that i'm not gonna tempt fate no more take some memory cloth to clean them axles up a little bit make them all nice and shiny I'll grab some grease these tires have bearings in them so I'm going to spray on the inside of the bearings. I'm 
Now, look at that. That's pretty cool. Sometimes if you can't find what you need, you guys got to improvise a little bit, I guess. Because they say it's a doggone good running lawnmower. And, uh, let's see, the motor is a 2009. So it's probably, what, 2010 model John Deere, I suppose. Still like in really good shape. Well, they couldn't get the parts for him, so I figured I'd try it. And this bar here, it's like this one adjustment right here. Adjust all four tires, which is kind of cool. Well, that's probably why that broke, though, too, all that stress on it. Anyway, I hope this video helped you out in some way. You know, if you can't find the right parts, you can try fixing the old ones or try a modific modification it or something. But anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. I appreciate you watching. If you like my videos, please press the like button and please subscribe. Anyways, you guys have a good afternoon.